मुझे लगा म्यूजिक ऐसे होगा ये सब नहीं हुआ भाई तो गाइस आई एम बैक विद मार्वल्स गर्जन ऑफ द गैलेक्सी सो गर्मी बहुत है भाई पानी पीते रहो कीप योर सेल्फ हाइड्रेटेड एंड बीट द हीट वी एंडेड एट द पार्ट वेयर वी वेर टेकन प्रिजनर बाय We're legitimate business like folk on legitimate like business. We're not hunting an illegal creature in legal space. There's so much wrong with this arrest. A, no way a kid should be here. I'm an official trainee. And B, I'm very very close friends with the captain. Uh, hold it right here. Is there a problem? Yes, no faith energy, no power. No power. No containment. <gasps> Texts are looking at it. They say that they cannot even fathom. How can they fix what they cannot understand? Put the Grand Unifier's mind at ease. Run the scanners again. What the flark is a Grand Unifier? Grand Unifier Grand Breaker, Unifier? leader Scanner. of the Church of Universal something. <laughs> He was floating dead in the quarantine zone, so looking dumb. for God. Right, Let's go. We caught him just like we caught you. The difference is. I know the captain. As I was saying, if you just tell the captain that I Mom explicitly said she doesn't want to see you. Yeah, Quill. Wait. Did she just say no? I'm just shut up. Hold on. I do not have the Nice to meet you, Nikki. <laughs> okay, Nikki, here's the plan. You're gonna jump and grab my legs while I hold on for dear life. That doesn't sound like. Trust me, kiddo. We got this. See? Ah, this is a weird. Get home. Doing great. Okay. That's kind of amazing. Whoa! Got it, legs. Yeah, mom wouldn't be impressed if I lost my first prisoner. <laughs> Your mom, right? Come on, we need to get out of here. There's a glass door around the corner. We'll be safe there. I think. Here, help me with this. Ready? Together. On three, two, one. Go, go. Okay. We need to keep moving. This Is that way. Yeah, Nikki. Whoa. Just stay close. I knew there was something wrong about that church ship. Who goes fishing for God in a junkyard? Blast doors kick in during emergencies. Pretty sure I can override them with my passkey. They give out override keys to trainees? Not exactly. Just give me a sec. Come on, come on. You no, know, I can probably help with the door if we undid these cuffs. Regulation 3B: Never undo restraints. Come on, you clearly need my help. No, you're my prisoner, and I got this. <laughs> Obviously. Ah! Okay, we're gonna have to find another way. 
We sure there isn't a way through here? I'm in charge. Whoa! Ah! <laughs> you okay? Yeah, I'm fine. You? Oh, dandy. Okay, this way. Shouldn't we be going up? Back toward the others? There's another blast door down here. Don't we establish a special... Whoa! Are you kidding me? Relax, you're fine-ish. I mentioned how useful my jet boots will be right now. Okay, I can do this. Not to rush you or anything. Almost there. Come on, kid. Yes! Got it! Through here. Whew. <laughs> nice work. Thanks. You didn't do too bad yourself, pirate. Only Star-Lord. Or Peter, or, you know... You have a cadet butt saver. Okay. Peter. So, listen. I have some good news and some bad news about your friends. Uh, start with the bad, I guess. Your friends have been processed and put in the brig. So what's the good news? They're not dead. Come on. That's the good news. Flark! Pipes must have burst. Should we try using that thingamajig of yours to call someone? We don't need help. I know what I'm doing. Now help me block this fire so we can get through. Sure. Just that everyone must be easy, does it? There, see? You don't need to worry about me. So I guess I didn't see Enough that. people around here do that already. For what it's worth, I think you're doing great. As good an arresting officer as I've ever had. How many have you had? Not that many. I just picked that part. What the hell is this? Is that robot wearing makeup? What? Oh, yeah. That's just it's. I um I know all the bots down here. They're kind of my friends, I guess. I reprogrammed most of them. And gave them faces. Maybe. No, I mean it's cool. Gives them personality. Very cool. Come on. This way. Does your mom know you play down here? Probably not. But what else am I gonna do? Not like there's any other kids on board. You know, I didn't have a lot of friends at your age either. Granted, I was in prison, but still. So mom was right about you. It was a Shatari prison. I was just a kid. I have so many questions. Were your parents in prison too? No, my mom, uh, died. I didn't know my dad. How do you know my mom, exactly? Uh, we fought together on Mercury during the war. She was, a, is, a real spitfire. More like real controlling. And bossy and judgmental? You're just a kid, Nikki. You don't know what's good for you, Nikki. Stay out of the escape pods, Nikki. <laughs> I kind of know what you mean. You do? This is a new low, Peter. Even for you, Peter. It's restricted space, Peter. <laughs> yep. That's her. You gotta sympathize with her. This because way. we are doing this journey in the... It's a dead end. Trust and me. Kids. Of course I trust you. Clearly. Just tend to... Do different Where do you think you're going? We do not Just making sure this place is safe and secure from the, the you know, thing. fire. This will give me upgrades. That's why I'm collecting the basic components. You can see the upgrades available is showing. I'm still in charge here, you know. Are you sure this is the quickest way to the brig? I thought you didn't want to go to the brig. Okay. Just trust me. If this is an attempt to escape your mom's ship, I really need to know. Because I may or may not be super interested. Just really need to make sure it doesn't look like a kidnapping. What? No, no. Oh, wow. Don't laugh. No, no. This is cool. It's like your secret hideout, right? Definitely prefer this to the brig. We're not staying. We just need to check on Ultimo. These gyros have been all screwy. Take your time. Take your time while I investigate this place. Hey, this is Mercury, right? Uh-huh. It's supposed to represent this 
big battle mom was part of. You said you were there, right? Oh yeah. Your mom was dead in the water until me and the Ravagers showed up. You should really fix this. You want me to draw you in? In the interest of historical accuracy. Hey, secret stuff. Off limits. No adults. I get it. Anyway, I'm all done here. We should probably get back before mom completely freaks. Yeah, I've seen your mom overreact before. It's like I'm not a kid anymore, you know? Tell me about it. So, you get where I'm coming from, right? Like, if you do end up talking to my mom, the subject of me happens to come up. You don't want her to know about your secret hideout. I get it. Uh, yes. And also everything else. Everything else, like... Like me having a passkey that overrides parts of the ship. The whole official trainee thing. Um, me being anywhere near the hangar bay. You know, just me in general. You never saw me. <laughs> That's why I... Need a hand? Yes! Got it! Mom? I can explain. Mom, seriously, A-okay, barely a scratch. What in Hall's name were you thinking? Sneaking out with an arresting squad, running around with criminals. Alleged criminals. You almost died. Do you have any idea how grounded you are right now? Mom, you promised to give me more leeway. Leeway doesn't mean lying to my officers or sneaking around behind my back. Look, it's my fault some guy's ship blew up. Restricted areas are restricted for a reason. You treat me like a prisoner. You're a child. Are you even listening? Whoa, whoa. We've all been through a lot today. Let's just all take a deep breath and <clears throat> recognize that maybe we've all made some mistakes. Make sure the fire is out and the hangar secure. Yes, Commander. And find out why that churchman's shuttle exploded. Grand Unifier Raker has been less than cooperative. Make him cooperate. And you two with me. Okay. overreact. You always overreact. Even Peter was saying so. Oh, he was, was he? I suspect Peter misspoke something he often tends to do. So I suggest you worry less about what he said and more about what I'm saying now. For the record, I didn't mean overreact, like, in a bad way. I mean, like, celebrating. What a moral person of conviction you are. That is not what you said! I don't care what he said. Upper level. Captain's quarter. Initiate lockdown. Lockdown initiated. I agree with the and mother can. What, are you gonna kill us? In theory, these doors don't open until I say so. Yeah, I know how lockdown works. I don't think you do, because somehow you keep bypassing every security measure on this ship, and I want to know how. Or you can just show me. Mom! You know, this reminds me of the last time I was stuck in an elevator. I was with this Shi'ar girl, and she... Ew! What is wrong with you? She was a lovely just person. Lightning Son, of the mood, man. Please, get out of here. No one leaves until you tell me what I want to know. Okay. I'm you already stomach. know everything. No, I don't. I know you're a magnet for danger, and that you somehow keep getting caught in restricted areas of this ship. I'm small. Okay. I fit into places. Being small doesn't get you past security, or through the hangar bay checkpoint, or the maintenance tunnel blast door. There was that system-wide glitch, remember? Yeah. Yeah, security was down for a while. No, it wasn't. Seemed pretty down to me. Are you seriously lying for a 12-year-old right now? 12? Oh, wow, I thought she was at least 16. Peter! What? <laughs> she really knew her stuff. She's a smart kid too smart. She keeps bypassing security. Unless you have a level 6 access to my ship all of a sudden? Didn't think so. Nicolette Gold, empty your pockets. No. You empty your pockets. Nikki? What? I still have feelings for you. Excuse me? Not like feelings feelings, but more like emotions. You know, because of the explosions and me and you and everything we went through back in the war. Good now. Okay, good. 
right now, if you don't mind. You stole a passkey? I didn't steal it. I made it. Points for ingenuity. Disengage lockdown. Lockdown disengaged. So, can I go help secure the hangar now? No, you can go back to your quarters and you can stay there for the next 30 rotations. But, Ma! I can make it 30 cycles. This looks like a so rough day, huh? Something like that. Exploding shuttles, quarantine zone trespassers, stop. missing kid. I have no idea. Chewy. I can't believe you still have them. Believe you survived. Mercury was what, like a thousand degrees? More like a thousand cycles ago. You can keep him if you want. He is yours. Hey, I ordered him to look out for you. Expect him to keep doing his job. Especially, you now have a daughter, apparently. Twelve year old daughter. We didn't have during the war. Twelve years ago when we... Peter. When we picked up your ship, part of me was excited. At first. But then after all this time, you haven't changed. At all. You're still the same... I've changed. Whatever the fine is, I'll pay. Just give me... Three cycles. Let me prove that I'm not still whatever it is you're going to finish that sentence with. You're going to pay 8,000 units in three cycles? Wow, okay, that is a lot of money. I was thinking that maybe... The fine's non-negotiable. My search party found a Class two biohazard wandering around your ship. That's all they found, right? Okay, okay. You'll get your money on time, no problem. This Guardians of the Galaxy thing, we are this close to getting it off the ground. And if I didn't have these handcuffs on, I would show you just how very close we are. <laughs> Why do I feel like I'll regret this? No, oh, come on. When have I ever... You won't regret it! Promise. You've got three cycles, Peter. Not four, not five, three. Contact me when you've got the units. And if we don't? The device we installed will deactivate your ship, and you will all go to prison. Gotcha. We won't let you down. What the hell, Peter? You said you could get us out of this. I did. 8,000 units is a small price. 8,000 to... units? That is a tremendous sum. Where are we going to get that kind of money in three cycles? By robbing a freaking bank, apparently. Okay. So we got fined. So we have a Nova tracking thing on our ship that's going to shut down our engines if we don't pay that fine in three cycles. At least we're not on a prisoner transport. Not yet. Oh, come on, guys. You're Drax the Destroyer, man. You killed Thanos. Allegedly. Are you going to let a little fine slow you down? And Gamora, you're practically an MI6 agent, but way hotter and cooler. There's nothing you can't do. Here it comes. Rocky, you're an actual genius and the scrappiest dude I know. How many prisons did you break out of? Seven. Seven. I am Groot. You are Groot. Guys, we're supposed to be a team. All we need to do is figure out how broke we are and come up with a plan. So check your quarters. Check between the sofa cushions. Check under the crafting bench. If you find any spare units lying around, grab them. I'll do the same in my quarters. All right. 
This is why you don't sleep with cops, Quill. They put bombs on my ship. My ship. So I don't know uh, where is my water. I am watching you, Rodent. What's that supposed to mean? It is common knowledge that rodents hoard. Nuts, stolen technology, units. <sighs> okay, first off, I ain't a hoarder, nor a rodent. I know you have a stash hidden aboard this ship. Fetch it, now. There ain't nothing to fetch. Groot blew our stash on Contraxia. Peter Quill. Tell the rodent that his selfishness endangers us all. Rocket, we could really use any extra units you have. How do I gotta spell it out for you? I don't got no units! Fair enough. You believe his lies? Oh, I ain't lying. Now why don't you leave me alone and bother someone else instead? I intend to. Open this door! I know you are in there, sentient tree! Do not think that I do not know what you are up to. Your rodent co-conspirator has clearly stashed his illicit units in there. I am watching you, tree. This is not my room. Actually, I think we saw this, right? Why does this thing look so sinister? Hey, who said you could touch that? I don't go into your room and touch your stuff, Quill. What? You hacked my visor and added a scoreboard to it while I was sleeping. Eh, that was different. I improved it. Also, did anyone tell you that you snore? I thought Drax was bad, but wow. Quill, you should really get that checked. You sound like a Torg. I don't snore that loud. <laughs> yeah, okay. So what is this thing anyway? It kind of looks like a metal face hugger. That is clearly a spinal control unit. Yes, right, of course, a, a spinal control thingy. Back on Half-World, Kree scientists used these to keep us super soldiers in line. Uh, they'd press a big, fun red button and zap! Instant obedience! Holy crap. Rocket. Sorry, man. I'll give you some space. Let's check it. He has an unrecognized link to the captain's chair. Unauthorized link to the captain's chair. Oh my god. I think this is. Yeah, Gamora's. Hey, Bluebird, you copy? I know you think I sold you out and. Who are you talking to? What's a bluebird? It, um, was Yondu's call sign. He was bluebird and I was the kid. <laughs> <laughs> Let me get this straight. Yondu Udanta, leader of the Ravager Space Virus, scourge of the Sirius system and all-around scoundrel, used bluebird as his call sign? <laughs> Even had it embroidered right. on the back of his jacket. Amazing. Okay. It was amazing. Pretty Don't much from the day we met. How did you two meet? Terrans and Centaurians aren't exactly neighbors. We met on Chitari Prime. About three years into my sentence. Wait. Yondu was a prisoner of war? I, I, I thought the Ravagers were neutral. They were. And they also weren't. 8,000 units bohat zyada hota I don't really want to talk about this right now. Could we, uh... Sure. I'm around if you need me. Well, well, well. 
Let's see if we can find some stray units in here. Really? Thirty-seven units? <laughs> we appear to be 7,963 units short. If we intend to keep our ship, Peter Quill... I know, I know. We clearly need a plan. And reconsider my initial proposal. Oh, no, not Fin Fang Foom again. Yes, we should go after Fin Fang Foom. Drax, there are easier ways to get paid. Like, what about selling Gamora's crap? What? Oh, come on. You've been hoarding them stupid knickknacks ever since you first joined us. I mean, don't tell me they ain't worth nothing. The quarantine zone was always there. Holding out My on figurines quill. are not knickknacks. Huh, team's in trouble. Then you can't be bothered to make no sacrifice. For the I will star sacrifice system. your head. And take us to the majestic mo- Guys. I think we should hear out Groove for once. Hi. <laughs> Ain't nobody he says we it. should combine both ideas. Sell Gamora's trinkets to Fin Fang Foom. It is brilliant. Yeah, you know, the only problem with your plan is that Lady Hellbender only buys monsters. And you are not a monster. He's not. He's the sweetest, most... I am Groot. No, you don't. This ain't something you can pretend. Oh, yeah? You want monster? I'll show you monster! Whoa, guys! Groot, are you really offering to... No, no, he is not offering that, okay? It could work. So, Groot, I guess we could bust him out after. Absurd! Lady Hellbender seeks the monster within. The small, ugly one is clearly the correct choice. He is cruel, sadistic, and his soul is filthy and filled with rage. The monster Queen would pay a great sum for such a creature. Really? How great? How are you okay with this? Because I know what I am. And I know what he ain't. I am Groot. I vote we saw Groot. I honestly think Lady Hellbender will go for it. Yeah, well, I vote for not Groot. I also vote for the creepy little beast. Two votes each. Peter? Do I have it at the end? Well, Rocket's definitely scarier on the inside. He's unstable and vicious and totally oblivious to the needs of others. <clears throat> okay, we, uh, we get it, Quill. The point is, is I think you'd make a fine monster. And we'll definitely need that tactical brain of yours to bust you out once you're in there. But just to be 100% sure, you're definitely okay with this. Uh, are you kidding? I can't wait to hold this over you. <laughs> All right, let's do this. Let's go sell a monster. Okay, so we are here to sell the rocket. We're not seriously flying into that. They say the weather patterns of Seknarf 9 are tied to the temperament of its ruler. That's not how women work. Or weather. Anyways, I'm sure it looks worse than it is. There! That's Lady Hellbender's fortress. Get us in close, Quill. I don't want to walk in this. Whoa! <laughs> yep! No we're flying the wrong way. Nah, he's not flying it. Guys, relax! Just one adjustment! <laughs> Piece of cake! <sighs> he can't be serious. What? This way we can scope things out before we finish the transaction. We're like a hundred clicks from her base. You know how much I like scoping. Nope. So we are... Next time, I'm flying. Monsters do not fly ships. Monsters do whatever they want. Going out. Don't you get all gloomy right now. Don't help. Because you're constant complaining, Daz? <laughs> you, 
You are complaining about the short one complaining. We're all complaining. Happy? Okay, here we go. I ever mentioned how much I hate rain? Hellbender's castle isn't even that far. That is not a castle. It is an impregnable fortress. So how do we impregnate it? Ask Peter! <laughs> Let's just get closer. We'll figure it out on the way. Lightning is like polymorph. There is nothing to figure out. As beast merchants, we will easily gain access to Lady Hellman. Good! We've already got a beast. All that's left is the merchant part. Good thing I put on my official merchant costume. There is no such thing. Right? Ouch! Hey, is my jacket all right? At least you got a jacket. Some of us are soaking here. Less whining, more walking. Hey, right. Stormlord, we ain't seriously walking through this. It'll take forever in this storm. Stop complaining. The hardship will strengthen your spirit. We won't walk, we'll hike. It'll be fun. Woohoo! Team hiking trip. That's just a fancy word for walking. Come on, at least you won't be bored. We got this. Just don't fall and we'll be fine. Hit by lightning. I would not expect a Chitari trader to understand the underlying value. The underlying value of getting killed. Of being direct, you child of subterfuge. What is your problem? Lady Hellbender scoffs upon duplicity and dishonor. Your reputation is why she tests us. Can we refocus here? We're here to trick some lady, not kill each other. She's not just some lady. Lady Hellbender's a known warrior. And a queen. And stinking wreck. Exactly. She's a stinking rich warrior queen businesswoman, and she won't be able to resist a good deal. Same as us. Perhaps some of us. Oh, that was way too close. Well played, Lady Hellbender. So we're still doing this? Yes! Guys, focus. Keep an eye out on those big blue ones and take cover when they hit. Resistance ship. Thing's been shot to hell. No doubt by this one and her Chitauri friends. We weren't friends. Uh, guys. Are you good? Eh, not sure. But it ain't moving now. I would be wary, Rodin. Eh, uh, you know what? I survived freaking half world. I think I'm scared of some little black! It's not alone. Get ready! Slime's 
Take help from Groot because I think they can help. Okay. Barely a 
Yeah. 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 around here looks like? We are outside Lady Hellbender's sanctuary. The creatures here are not her pets. We sort of do look like food. This husk should be easier to climb than the muddy terrain. I ain't comfortable calling it a husk, seeing as we're about to climb it and all. It is the hollowed husk of a bygone time. The turmoil of war raged stronger than the storms of this world. Peter, get moving. Drax is having an existential meltdown. What does your magical mask reveal? Give me a second. Okay. Hey, Starpants. See anything we can climb on? Not really, but maybe if we cleared the gunk off the side. Shall I rip it apart then? Let's go easy if we can. Keep in mind this old thing helped win the war. Okay. All right. Oh. Oh. Having fun? Didn't think I'd ever be shooting at a resistance ship. Drax, you can pull this reactor out gently, right? If it were combustible, the rodent would have shot it by now. He makes an excellent point. Shall I continue ripping it apart? No, no, no. I think we're good. Let's try this. Beats me. It's dead now, though. Anyone else hear something? Hear what? Great. There they are. Wing controls. Mud in this area smells queer. It's them jelly things we fight. All right, Rocket. That wing control panel's all yours. Hope it still works. Great. Everyone watch out for beeping red lights. What? Why? This is a resistance ship. We'll be lucky if there's only one booby trap on it. That'll do it. That don't sound like no jelly thing. Say that Lady Hellbender is called Echoes throughout the planet. That don't sound like no lady either. Okay, so let's recruit. Careful! Looks like something big moved through here. Yay! You see something there, Drax? Something interesting? This place is a flark and maze. If you see anything with claws the size of Drax, let me know. I thought we already had our monster. What's she tracking this thing for? For sport. Nothing wrong with a little sport. A girl has to keep busy. You are looking for trouble, assassin. Okay, so we got... I am eager to experience Lady Hellbender's legendary glory. Ooh, and mysterious. Found something cool. Yeah, some kind of cave. Maybe it's got hidden treasure. Or hidden bodies. Oh, please don't let there be a space baron here. And hello, mystery goo. I think there's... There's gonna be a fight. Monster eggs. Yay. Okay, so note to self. 
If it looks like a monster cave and smells like a monster cave. No, just trying to stay ready. Jelly dudes, I took care of it. Fudge Scott! I knew I should have come down earlier. Wait, so where are you? Cave with an X. Where are you? Still checking things out. This place is bigger than I thought. <laughs> nice hidden passage. I ain't far, Quill. Scream really loud if you find another blob creature. You know I will. I think we have to go back. You got a real knack for sniffing out smelly caves, Quill. What can I say? I follow my nose. I'd rather follow my gut. Okay. So we're not going that way. Let's... Let's... Are you two coming? Yeah, just a sec. We're having a moment. A moment? You done exploring, Quill? Cause, uh, I really need to talk to you. There's something, um, personal I need to get off my chest. All right, man, what's up? Look, there's no easy way to say this, so I'll just say it. I think I'm dying, Quill. Even with all these frickin' augmentations. Shut knows what else I, I just... I had no idea, man. Does Groot know? No. No, no, no. And, uh, you can't tell him. It'll destroy him. If the day comes that I... Just promise me you'll take care of Groot. I promise. And, uh... Are you... In that, uh... Are you messing with me? <laughs> um, you know, say you'll bury me. In the... In the Milano. <laughs> Oh, I can't believe your face. It was like, I, I can't even describe your freaking face. What is wrong with you? Why would you even joke about something like that? Because it's funny. You don't think it's funny? Come on. Come on. The sooner we get the Lady Hellbender, the sooner we can focus on paying that stupid fine. Easy for you to say. You ain't the one getting auctioned out. We are going to Lady Hellbender. Peter Quill, I have found the way forward. You sure, Drax? No. Good enough. There's further proof that we are not broken here. If we turn back every time we have wanted, we never go anywhere. Good thing we have a plant guy to take care of a plant problem. He says plants aren't problems. Drax, think this is a sign from Lady Hellbender? We are clearly not wanted on this planet. This planet is not just me. Everything's fine until you see the way it's going. That is precisely why it is majestic. Can you get us through here, Gamora? Whatever it takes to find Hellbender. Her name is Lady Hellbender. Yeah, Gamora. If we want an audience with him, we will have to start showing some respect. This, from the guy who calls me Harlot Spawn of Thanos. An accurate description. We all know which Harlot Spawn at first. Gamora's actually adopted, so not even that accurate. Uh, yeah. Also, not a Harlot. Right, right. That, too. 
We'll need to find a way out of this jungle. Why? It's dry down here. Should we ask them for directions? I'm thinking maybe they are directions. Seriously? Oh, like a signpost or something. I'm not saying it's an arrow with the word fortress on it, but statues of dead civilization. And the only settlement I saw when we were topside was Lady Hellbender's fortress. Interesting. I don't lay eggs. Hmm. Looks more alien than the other ones. They are all alien. I know they're all alien. I mean, this one's uh, dead end. That's just great. Wait, is that Chitauri tech over there? Ask the Chitauri. No, no, it is. It's a retractable bridge. They used them at the prison I was in. Too bad the controls are on the other side of the giant chasm. What do you not have time to dawdle in this jungle? I shall hurl the creature over the chasm so he may activate the bridge. I may activate a hole through your face! Put me down! We're not throwing rocket. Very well. You sons of forking dogs! How will we cross? Don't face the Look around, we'll find another way. Atari tech doing on a backwater mud ball like this. Shooting your way out of every problem again, Peter? Trying to. Yeah, yeah, I'm fine. Just leave it. What's your problem? My problem is Meathead trying to hug me over a cliff. You're overreacting. I did not throw you. Only because Quill stopped you. Then there should be no yes. problem. I'm watching you. Another you can have psychopath. Sure. Wow, it is dark in here. If you bump into any monsters, let us know. Monster planet, right. Hey, my shooting's not aimless. Everything I do with purpose and, you know, heroism. we could fashion a catapult. We're not throwing rocket. But maybe there's something else here. Let me search. A miracle it's still standing in these storms. Okay, so... Drax? Drax! Stop. Think you can topple this? I may have angered them. Them? We're being hunted. Great. All right. Let's try not to fall. That's your pep talk. <clears throat> Great place to leave a sculpture. Wait. Hear that? Yeah, Boys up, people. Incoming! Ah! I was born for this! <laughs> I have a sweet to threat. Return to the skirmish. Appreciate the help, you guy. I killed one of them on my own. 
It's all right. We will die. We'll do it again. But it's like we shouldn't die. I need to upgrade, right? Why not? Yes, I know we're in a fight. Get it out of your system before we get there. Mine's your thing, right? All right, Gamora. Pretty sure it's this way. 50 units, that's the name. He doesn't have 50 units. I... No way are we almost there. Still got like half a planet to walk across. Lady Hellbender could cross this jungle in seven strides. Sure she could. Or she would have flown over the mountains. Oh, she flies now. Drax, some of your Lady Hellbender tidbits are questionable. You can say that again. More or less questionable than your flying skills, Peter Quill. He's got you there. Gamora, mind cutting us a path? They say that Lady Hellbender feels it every time you cut a piece of her jungle. Oh, an old Nova bomber. I haven't seen one of these since the war. I remember it used to take a dozen ships to bring one down. A dozen ships or one Chitauri infantry. I'll take that one as a compliment. Still no sign of the fortress? No. Now what's the hold up? Fear. No. Just thinking someone else should cross the death pit first. Me and Groot are the merchandise. Only one of you is the merchandise. Plan A and plan B, okay? Just go. No, you just someone go. Someone go. Don't leaders usually cross first? 
not if it's dangerous, because I need to cover everyone. Right. See, it's fine. Perfectly safe. Fine. Do not even think of pushing the assassin. There are so many better ways to kill someone. Easy does it. What the fuck? I'm trying to hear you. Groot says there's something down there. It doesn't matter. Of course it matters. It's unstable either way. Just move. This is not done, bro. I died almost three times. Almost what? I died three times. Three times to one chuka man. Don't get used to it. Peter Quill, you're not alone here. Yeah, I got it. Right, guys, anyone know what that is? Running away. But that its tail between its legs. I say we go after it. Finish the job. Anyone ever tell you you're scary? Yes. I mean, there's obviously a way out up there, which is exactly what we need. Plus, it'll give us eyes on where we need to go. It is settled. The 
scale this down contraption. Yeah, okay. How do we do that? Good question. Starting to wonder if I should be the one with the fancy visor. I wouldn't trust a thing you said. We agree for once. I too would prefer Peter Quill's incompetence to the rodent's lies. Huh. Looks like there's one of those vintage workbench things back here. Okay, Rocket, let's see if this thing still works. Yeah, alright. Just better not get jumped by any monsters. Got you covered. Can't bring this. Ding, ding, done. They're doing tactical scan. And voila! Double this and more. Start your charge now. Waiting for you so that we can scale this contraption. Ah, right. Gotta say, I get some sick satisfaction from seeing this thing buried in the ground. Had a few run-ins with Novacore rocket? More like run fronts. <laughs> These things could turn on a dime. Meant for getting in close to dreadnoughts, but also makes them hard to shake when they're chasing you. Gamora, how high up this thing can you climb? Let's find out! Are you relishing this moment, assassin? What moment? Visiting the grave of your enemies. No, the Corps weren't my enemies, Drax. They were my father's enemies. See anything useful up there? I got eyes on this gunked up reactor. A couple of shots should bring it down. The reactor thing there is pretty loose. And pretty gunked up. Ugh. Yo, Quill, check out the upper wing strut. Looks pretty compromised to me. All right, pretty sure that baby's our ticket upward. Somehow. It is neither a baby nor a ticket. It is a reactor. At this rate, by the time we get there, Hellbender will have moved on from monster collecting. <laughs> Yes, I am obviously being sarcastic. Just saying, it shouldn't take this long to get to her. Drax, moving that thing around ain't a problem, right? It is not. Just like the mighty lady Hellbender, I am exceptionally muscular. Got it, Drax. This unit is tremendously heavy. I thought you were exceptionally muscular. What next, Peter Quill? This wreck is so rusted out, you can hardly see the blue. Group, any suggestions? He says we should use it to upgrade the Milano, which is a terrible idea. It clearly ain't compatible. Huh. First a down resistance ship, now a Nova Corps one. Two out of three on Galactic War Bingo. Maybe this was a staging ground for the push against the Shatari. Gamora, can you use the reactor to get up the ship? Not when it's over there. Are we sure we want to go uh, back up? I'm uh, getting used to not being completely soaked. Perhaps the storm will have a baby. At the rate we're moving? Hey, big guy, lift that thing up. You can put it down here. Shall be done. Perfect. Thanks, Drax. What purpose does it serve over here? You'll see, you'll see. Just be patient. I have merely followed our leader's directions. I see. I see. Don't take too long. We got a castle to get to. No giant monster. All good.
If they are in there, they wouldn't be mummified. Environment's too damp. There you go, bud. So maybe they are plants. Evo, Drax! Right about there. I am on my way. Drew, is there any way you could bring down that wing? Root ain't that strong. He says you want something sharp. Can you get up there now? Should only take a second. This brings back memories! Hmm. Impressive. See? That was easy. Great teamwork, everyone. I helped in spirit. <laughs> All right. Slippery wind pummeled treetops, here we come. You know, I uh, really admire our team's commitment to safety. One thing is clear. We would never have accomplished this task without the assassin. Did Drax just praise Gamora? I am giving credit where credit is due. Took you long enough. We all know Gamora's super cool oh, and girl. super valuable. There it is! Lady Hellbender's fortress! It's gotten bigger, that's for sure! Looks like there's a way down here! Yeah, but Whoa, I don't know you way. gotta see this ship! Behold, Lady Hellbender's wrath. Even the Chitauri feared her. They didn't fear many back then. Okay, here we go! Oh, slimy. Uh, guys? You might want to wait to come down here. Oh, why the flark is so deep? In a jam, boys? You think? Son of a schmack, breach! Sword will not work, woman. Find us a rope. Yeah, it fast. Where am I supposed to find a rope? I don't know. I'm sticking in jelly here. Well, do something! Like what? Flark, flark. Bring the mouse pointer and also the arrow pointers inside the circle. I was less startled around what to do. Something like <laughs> glowing in my gun. Sala patai ni chalta kya karna. Achanak se agya bhai. So apan take kar lenge koi dikkat nahi. Slimy. Guys, you might want to wait to come down here. Oh, why the flark is so deep? In a jam, boys? You think? Son of a schmack, breach! Sword will not work, woman. Find us a rope. Yeah, it fast. Where am I supposed to find a rope? I don't know. I'm sinking in jelly here. Well, do something! Like what? Flark, flark, flark. Quill, Quill.
You might want to wait to come down here. Oh, why the flark is so deep? In a jam, boys? You think? Some schmack breach! The sword will not work, woman. Find us a rope. Yeah, it fast. Where am I supposed to find a rope? I don't know. I'm sticking in jelly here. Well, do something! Like what? Glasses, they I've only done that once before when I was a kid. I don't do it on purpose. Classic Spartoi tech. Just when you think you've seen it all, it pulls scud like this. I, I, just, could you just please the guns me, alone? Me, I, I, quite like this. Want to see how they tick? Otherwise, it might as well be magic or sorcery. Guys, do you know what the next couple of some kind of morphing animal or sorcery? Here we go again. Climb up and over. Ding, ding, ding! Give that man a gold star. Let's figure out how to make it climbable. Stars are made of hydrogen, not gold. The planetary. If I never see another one of these ships again, it'll be too soon. Wonder if we can get anything to pop out of the side of that wreck. Come on, Quill, let me get a look at them guns. No. Rocket, can you extend that cannon? With my brute animal strength? No. Quill, 
Check if that sucks. Drax, think you can drag this cannon out? I will try. Okay. It is more stubborn than expected. Any way you could bring that one down with vines or something? <laughs> Drax, can you drag out that higher cannon? Impossible. It is too far from the ground. Okay. We've got to find a way to lock it in place. Drax, can you try again? Why? It does not stay. I'm working it out. Trust me. I, I cannot hold it forever! No, I can't do Scott from outside the ship. Why will you not yield? Because it's attached to a Drax. Can you try again? Succumb to me, fiendish machine! Peter Quill, you can't get it! Impressive, Peter Quill. Now we gotta get the next one out. that cannon? I can, but I won't be able to get it out if that's what you want. Rocket, any ideas on getting that top one out? Not from this angle, no. able to work something loose from the inside. Rocket, I need you to squeeze inside that little hole and try to knock the gun loose from the inside. Hello, Shatari ship, full of booby traps and death mechanisms. But you love both those things. Uh, you're right, I do. And I always wanted to see the inside of one of these bug bombers. Fine. Oh, what reeks in here? That, oh, God. Ah, ah. You okay in there, Rocket? I found the crew. I guess not even the worms want to eat that Shatari meat. Rocket. Relax. Just gonna reroute the little bit of remaining power to the cannon and... Nothing. You know what? Clark it. I'm blowing it up. What? Hang on. Think about all the booby traps in... <laughs> Look at it go. He must have jump-started the thing. Rocket, you okay? <laughs> yeah, and dry now, too. There, now we have our way up. Gamora, can you clear us a path through that junk? Sure. Yes, Peter Quill. Onward to the palace of the great giantess. Oh, so she's a giantess now. It is said that Lady Hellbender stands 50 heads tall. Doesn't tell you much. Depends whose head. Ever met a regalian? Okay. <laughs> yes! Their heads are ridiculous! the bridge always on the wrong side. This time I insist we hurl the foul beast. And I insist we push muscles over the side of the cliff. To what end? Yours! <laughs> you 
How many times do I have to say it? We're not throwing rocket. Ridiculous. You were holding us back to spare the beast's feelings. When has he done the same for us? Put him down. Just be a lesson to you. Oh, I'll show you what a lesson looks like. Knock it off, guys. We're supposed to be professionals. We're better than this. I'm not. Letting a measly Chitauri installation stop our progress is unprofessional. Then stop wasting time arguing. We'll find another way across. It, maybe we can go around it. Looking for cracks, caves, or crevices, people. I feel like I've heard you say that before, but in a different context. So we are going around it. Guys, I've got something here. It's deep. This looks promising. There's little room to maneuver if something should attack. We're not going to be here long. Anybody see a way through? We'll make one if we have to. Anybody else smell that? It really stinks back here. Yes, it smells putrid. Ugh. Where is it coming from? Oh, what the fuck? Ugh. Not talking. <gasps> Not even breathing. Shouldn't we at least have a leash for our monster? There's usually some acting involved in this kind of infiltration. Lady Hellbender is an astute buyer. Either she will want what we are selling, or she will not. I think the smell's coming from that wall here. There's gotta be something behind it. In many ways, this planet reminds me of my home world. That bad, huh? Yep. Definitely something gross behind here. Drax, can you chuck that through the stink wall? I fear I will regret this. Uh, that is disturbingly fragrant. Uh, uh, I am clutching every order. A whole lot of alien poo guys. Okay, that's kind of weird. Hello? Anybody? Not a cheater. Not a cheater. Will I? Whoa! Dead. <laughs> okay, that got my <clears throat> blood pumping. Why would Lady Hellbender cage this creature? Uh, because it's annoying as scud. Perhaps it is food. That thing's food? Yes, monster food. I wonder what it tastes like. Peter. Why would it taste like that? We can use this. You know, we really got monster food? Taste, the cage! We need the cage. Taste we go into that fortress with our with our monster peacefully walking beside us. We'll be laughed right out of the room. Any bites? Why are you You're whispering? Well, uh, the thing. Two more thinks we can sell our monster act because better if we have a proper cage. Is why. Only problem oh, is, there's a pissed off monster way. inside. Release the beast, let me dispose of it. Because that worked so well for you last time. We need a better plan of attack. Yes. Ideally, one that guarantees my safety as leader. <laughs> He's back!
this is gonna be a uh, hell lot hard fights coming fights bahut hard hone wala hai bhai ye sab chhota mota chingu marne ke liye ye halat ho raha hai teen char baar mar ja raha hu main Especially the stinky slime tunnel part. Itchy fur is where I draw the line. Hey, I just went through the same crap you did, and I smell amazing. Ah, sure you do. It's my sexy hero, Musk. Group, give me a bridge here. The fortress is right on the other side of those cliffs. Pretty sure it's this way, but I don't see an easy way to get up there. Easy is rarely worth the effort. with the monster queen. How much are we asking for our monster? 395 million give it back. One for every precious hair flowers on this flawless body. You have counted them. It was bizarre. Hey, at least I have something to count. Here we are almost to the... So... What do we do if all don't go well with Lady H? We're gonna fight a monster queen? She would be a formidable adversary indeed. And if all don't go well? Then we'll oh, know we should have sold Bruce's That is dead. definitely my top ten fortresses. Got a ticking time bomb on the ship, and we owe money to the cops. Guys, every misstep was just a step in the right direction towards completing our best plan yet. Say that again? What if we brought one of those ugly suckers all the way here only to find out Lady H already had a full set? That would have sucked big time. Exactly. If we even got that... Well, let's just get this done. Oh, 
You can't be serious. Okay. It's farther than it looked. Much farther. It's a fork in infinity bridge is what it is. Why are you being dramatic, Rodent? The bridge ends at the fortress, therefore it is not infinite. Yeah, that's super comforting. Guess we gotta go. Three cycles. Peter? Aren't you forgetting something? Are you Oh, right. The cage. The point of even getting the flark thing is looking like a mean business. All right, Rocket. Time to put on your monster face. I only got one face, Quill. Are you sure about this, Peter? <laughs> Look at him. You better have one hell of a sales pitch. Remind me again. How many missions have we been on so far? Thirteen. Fourteen, if you count Contraxia. Contraxia was not a mission. It was a mistake. All right. Point is, is I was able to sell you. Gamora, daughter of Thanos, intergalactic assassin. As a hero. Fourteen times! <laughs> Fine. I think he's made his point. <laughs> Let's go, guys. Dra Gamora, can you help me with no. this? What? Why? To guarantee your safety as our leader. Ah, oh, come on. <laughs> She's got you there, Quill. Now shut up and start pulling. Will you stop worrying so much? You're gonna start growing knots again. Okay, here we go. real well when I was a kid. I guess this sort of counts. I'm sure it's real pretty, but can we not draw its attention while I'm stuck in a flarkin' cage, please? So we are still walking. Does anybody have like a campfire song or something we can sing to kill the time? Ooh, ooh, I know one. It's called... Please stop. All right, yeah. Okay. Wait. Is please stop the name of your song? No. Okay. So, how long before someone else wants to pull this thing? There are 60 clicks from the fortress. I'd say closer to 75. There is only one way to know for sure. 0 0.1 clicks. 0 0.2 clicks. 0 0.9. 2 0.1. 0 0.3 clicks. 4.5. 0 0.4 clicks. 0 0.5 clicks. 0 0.6 clicks. For the love of the Lord, stop counting clicks. We quick take turns to restore the virtues of Mark Sweet. Quietly. What are you doing here, Pete? Stop. Why are you chowing? What the hell is happening? You don't have to do that. You don't have to do that. Myself. What the fuck is happening, man? Thirteen whole years. Why did we stroll Look into the you. dream again? Where does time go? I'll be up in a sec, I promise. Right. Yeah. Okay, this is the next part oh, of the thing. That was fast. Give me a sec. I didn't think you'd actually come up. Maybe being on time is my new thing. Oh, right. We'll see about that when I have to get you up for school tomorrow. You know, I think I'm too old for that, too. Nice try, smart Alec. Sit. Don't worry, I'm not going to sing. I like your singing. That's a nice well, you might kid. be the only one. Go on, make a wish. You're officially a teenager. Look 
at all those girlfriends. Someone's going to be really popular at school. Mom. What? You are very handsome. I'm sure all the girls are going to be falling off. Mom. On. What did you wish for? Why would I wish for anything? I've got everything I want. <laughs> oh, what huge favor are you about to ask me? Just ten bucks. Dan, Andy, and I want to go see Night of the Cosmos at the Rio tonight. A movie? Tonight. Come on. It's going to be sick. It's about these zombies that invade Earth, and then it's up to these kids that have to blow them away. Why is that mom? I don't think I want you to see that, Peter. I let you watch the hockey mask one, and you were sleeping in my bed the next three nights. That was ages ago, and this one isn't even that bad. It's PG-13, and I'm 13. Exactly, PG-13 may contain violence and nudity. Mild nudity, like butts and stuff. You're not helping your case. No, I just, I, I wanted us to have some us time tonight, you know? Maybe finish our game. You can't duck out right when I'm about to win. We can still do all that stuff. Or some of it. Tomorrow. You're always telling me to get out of the house more. A movie theater does not count as out of the house, and you know it. Pretty please? I don't know. Truck's still in the shop, and I don't want you walking alone in the dark. There's been a lot of weirdos out there. It's not safe. I'll be careful, Ma. I always am. Were you careful when you got that black eye? I told you I, I was- I know! You were standing up for someone, which is a good thing. But you cannot go punching your way out of every problem, Peter. I couldn't just stand there. No. Of course not. Okay, get me my purse. Why is she afraid of the outside world? Not so fast. Before you go, there's something I want to talk to you about. Something I want to give you. Twenty bucks? Don't push it. <laughs> Think of it as a long overdue gift from your father. It's upstairs on my bed. Go on and get it while I finish up in the kitchen. And we can open it together. Ten bucks is a lot. It's actually a lot. Okay, so we are bringing something. I want you home right after the movie. Little guy put up a big fight. Wouldn't have been able to land him without Grandpa's tricks. So what am I searching for here? Sometimes Grandma and Grandpa would let me sleep with them if I was too afraid down in the basement. Man, am I glad I finally got my hair the way I like it. I miss them so much. Grandma used to take me into town on Sundays to run errands. We'd stop for ice cream on the way home. Even in winter. But that's... This. I don't know much about art, but I know that this is excellent. Grandma really had talent. Okay, so this is a present. I know it sounds crazy, but Mom's convinced my dad was an alien. She really believes it. Could she be right? At last! I think that story for another time. Huh? We have arrived at the Monster Queen's fortress. At its entrance, anyway. So, as I was saying, I can handle a little solo extraction. No offense, but you ain't exactly invested in my safe return. My skin, my plan. Your call, Peter. The fork it is. I'm the one in the box, lady. Peter Quill is our leader. The burden of your possible death falls on his shoulders. Fully on board with Rocket's plan that I was totally paying attention to. See? Even Captain Space Cadet don't trust your gymnastics. Wait, uh, yeah, yeah. what about gymnastics? 
I just think we shouldn't be relying on a piece of tech you won't even be around to use. Are they serious? Yes, we're going to fight. Even you mouth breathers can figure it out. Lame. Guardians of the Galaxy. Never heard of you. I am Groot. Bonafide monster sellers. Today, anyway. What's in the box? A monstrous abomination from Halfworld and the meanest SOB in the Quadrant. Pass. Pass? Rocket! I mean... Things puny. It is a hell beast, the namesake of your mistress. It would be wise to reconsider. Alright, get going. Before I change my mind. And if the lady don't like it, I'll be carting out what's left of you in that box. Hell beast? It is an accurate moniker. The little beast has a hellish demeanor. I like it. Not exactly an easy way out if this all goes to hell. It's gonna go great. We got a killer monster and a solid plan. I would show more caution, Peter Quill. If Lady Hellbender realizes our deceit, her vengeance will be swift. What? I'm supposed to be scared just because she's got hell in her name? She runs a glorified zoo. That's no zoo. The Monster Queen has a monster army. Any chance they're the zookeepers with guns? I have never seen a monster's tamed. But I have seen one trample a man to pulp. It's fine. Worst comes to worst, we hightail it for the Milano. Your genius plan is run away? My backup plan? Which we're not gonna need, but yeah. No, it's not like she can chase after us with her own monster mash. <clears throat> oh, come on. Why did we not simply dock here and avoid the planet's inhospitable surface? We needed time to iron out the plan. Now it's foolproof. Lady Hellbender is no fool. When her monster goes missing, she'll assume it was us. Assume, yes, but not no. Not chases across the galaxy level of no, at least. Wow! Look at this place! I'm in the wrong line of work! It is appropriately impressive for a warrior of Lady Hellbender's stature. Someday, that's gonna be ours. <laughs> not yours. Focus, guys. Time to get those game faces on. I am Groot. He means you gotta sell the illusion, too. Exactly. The Galeran skull. That is truly a priceless trophy. Behold. Explain the vault. Priceless? Vault? Screw the sneaking around. Let's pull off a good, honest heist. No! no! I know what you meant. Do not claim for your food. You are not the first to claim they have captured a Tara Tara. Uh, you, you doubt its authenticity? If it is what you say it is, prove it. Or suffer the consequence of every other would be con artist. I assure you. I said, lady. release it. Got this.
contact. Bring in the next seller and transfer 10,000 units to that last one's next of you. Speak. Hey there, I'm Star-Lord. Okay. Drax the Destroyer. <laughs> the undoing of the Mad Titan in the flesh. Your presence honors me. You are much smaller than I expected. Oh? And what were you expecting? Perhaps I can do something about it. But uh, unlikely. We'll see, Destroyer. I can be quite forceful. she is flirting with me. Just play along, man. Flatter her or something. You got this. Just for the best. Your negotiation skills are terrible. Lady Hellbender, I can see by the size of your weapon that you must be a skillful warrior. Hmm. Perhaps I can give you a demonstration sometime. You would make an acceptable opponent. Tell me, Destroyer, what brings you to Sagnarf 9? Peter Quill, show her the creature. And it talks adorable. <laughs> uh, Quill, make it stop. <laughs> yeah, I wouldn't pet him like that again unless you want to lose a finger. He bites hard. I admire a creature with some spirit. What would you call it? It is a hell beast. It doesn't look like much. I didn't know any better. I'd think it was a woodland creature. True, but do we mention it's one of a kind? Just look deep into those angry raccoon eyes. I ain't a freaking raccoon! And you'll see that there's a monster in there. Big, scary, tree raccoons. And what would you like for the Hell Beast? Twenty thousand units. Twenty thousand. And not a penny less. Actually, we've already got an offer for twenty thousand units. From the collector. Floorboard. Was it? Actually, it's Star-Lord. Quiet. I know the kind of creatures the Collector seeks. If Tivan had made an offer on a Hell Beast, I would have heard. Since I heard nothing, it's clear you're lying. Oh my Silence! The creature is worthless to me. Worthless? You're worthless! So 15,000 then. I wouldn't even feed your hell beast to my pet flurkin. You have a pet flurkin? And I'm the worthless one? I'll show you worthless. Ah! Ah! What are you doing? Wait! 
Let me, Quill! Guys, less talking, more escaping! <laughs> What the fuck, Rocket? You heard that, Jackal! He wasn't gonna pay two units for me! So we all get to die because of your bruise, Ego? Ego nothing! This is about Ooh. money! Money that we can no longer collect. Whoa! That was lucky! Nothing about this is lucky! We can lucky. bicker later. We need to keep moving. Where are my drones? I want the Guardians incinerated! What is that? She's cheating! Oh, Quill, try something else. We can find a way out. Now. Clark, act out, or we will all perish. We need to get off this thing. That thing's coming in hot. We gotta cool its jets. We still need a way through. Well, stop wasting time. Everyone look for a way out. We need to get off this thing. That's very bad. We need an exit. No, 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 no! All right, then. We cannot bypass from this drone going like straight. You have to find another way. Or find another something to find a way out now. Clark, act now, or we will all perish. We need to get off this thing. That thing's coming in hot. We gotta cool its jets. We still need a way through. Well, stop wasting time! It ain't slowing down! We need to get off this thing! That won't hold it for long! We still need a way through! Anybody see a way out of here? see anything you cannot kill the drones so find a way out now Clark act now or we will all perish we need to get off this thing that thing's coming in hot. We gotta cool its jets. We still need a way through. Well, stop wasting time. That won't hold it for long. We need to get off this thing. Let's do it another time. 